All right, guys, welcome back to the channel. This is just the, the first part of my exhaust video for this car. This is a 2019 RS5 Sportback. It's got these 22 inch rims that I did a video about. You can check that, that should be uh, before this video. And uh, it also has these sweet blacked out tips. I mean, the stock ones were blacked out too with the package it had. They're very dusty right now. But uh, I'm going to take this to the wingman garage, you know, down the street and uh, get this on a lift and show you what it looks like. And then uh, I'll get it on the road and show you guys what it sounds like. All right, guys. All right, guys, we're back at the good old wingman garage here in Wadsworth, Ohio. If you want to know where this place is at and, you know, hook up an appointment and get your car on a lift, uh, link will be in the description. But uh, here's my 19 RS5. You know, it's got the 2.9 liter twin turbo. And I'm gonna show you what the underneath of this AW tuning uh, performance exhaust looks like from underneath the car. And then we will get it out on the road and show you what it sounds like. Here goes Aaron going up. So the car already does have the black optic package and the dynamic package. One of those has black sport exhaust tips. So these uh, AW ones look uh, very similar. All right, guys, like I said, you can get the package that gives you factory black exhaust tips. So these ones match, you know, pretty nicely. And they do have the, if you, you know, look up all the specs on their website, the noise cancellation 180, whatever technology. It's very nice grade of stainless steel. Very nice bends, you know, all the way to the front with no, it comes with this bracket, I'm sure. Hold on, let me get over this bump. You know, normally there's resonators, there's a pancake muffler, and then there would be, hold on, let's get over that bump. So there would be a pancake muffler, there would be some resonators, and then around here, I'm sure there would be a cat on each side. These just go up to the turbo, which has a cat right off of it. So this really only has two cats, one right after each turbo. I showed you briefly before I lifted the car up the engine bay. I'll show you the cats and the top part of this uh, here in a second when I get it down. But yeah, pretty decent uh, exhaust and uh, it's obviously been driven on for several miles. Still pretty good condition. All right, Aaron. Thank you very much. Everybody's got to come to Wingman Garage. This place is sweet. You got these people working on their car. He's working on his car. Everyone's do-it-yourself. But yeah, these uh, law tips. Pretty, uh, you know, good quality and they match. And then let me show you the cats here up in the front. Hey, Aaron, can you uh, pop this hood for me while I hold this here? I'll, I'll move the tab. There you go. Thank you, sir. But yeah, those are the cats. They come right off the turbos. So the cats right there and then it bolts onto the uh, tuning exhaust right down there somewhere. 
So eventually it's down, down pipe time, but it'll be a while before I do that. All right, let's get this thing started up, see what she sounds like, and then get her on the road. All right, guys, Aaron's going to back it up so I can rev it. So uh, here's the startup. All right, bro, you ready? Yep. All right, this is just a uh, number All right, guys, uh, it is the following day. I just wanted to make sure I closed the video out with a, a cold startup. Everyone wants to hear a cold startup. Um, I'm not gonna get any driving done today because it is, you know, raining. I will get that in a separate second video though, and I'll show you what all, both modes sound like while you're driving. This is a cold startup. down she's in a uh, open loop mode now pretty uh pretty light and then inside you know that no noise cancellation technology I saw or that I showed you that was on the uh, muffler it really does work inside there's really no interior drone it sounds really good inside but all right guys on to the next video